Hey everyone, I'm Amanda with Sweet Pieces. And today, I'm gonna to teach you how to glitz and glam up your piece really easy with Artisan Enhancements Leaf and Foil Size. So what is Leaf and Foil Size? Size is actually a glue. It makes a surface tacky and sticky. So you know, we've all seen those old world mirrors from Italy, and they're gold leafed and gilded and beautiful. Um, and gold leafing is a very similar process, but it's a bit more expensive and it's very messy. If you've ever touched gold leaf, you know you literally touch it with your hands and it crumbles all over the place. So this is the same kind of concept, but it's really much, much easier. So leaf and foil is actually a three-step process. You're first going to apply leaf and foil size, which is, again, that glue medium. And we sell this in two sizes, a quart container and an eight ounce jar. And then you're going to apply your foil, which comes like this on a sheet. We actually sell six gorgeous colors here at Sweet Pieces, black, gold, turquoise, pewter, copper, and silver. So you can order these all on our website. And if you don't need a ginormous roll, which is actually 200 feet, you can order it by the foot, which is really great. Um, so one foot will go a really long way. So before we got on camera here, I uh, painted this side of the M with the leaf and foil size. I don't know, can you tell on camera? Great, okay. And over here, I have not painted any leaf and foil size. So I just put a little in a bowl here and I'll just show you how you paint it on. It's really easy. Now, wherever you paint leaf and foil size, that's where the foil is going to stick to. So I'm just painting it inside my M here. Okay, and can you see how this is white? You're, when you first paint the leaf and foil size on, it's gonna look white. When it's dry and it's ready for foil, it's gonna look clear. You can also tell by putting your finger on, and if you pull it off, do you hear that little sound? That is like a snapping sound that it's making. That means it's tacky, it's sticky, it's ready to go. So I am just gonna quickly paint in here. Um, so leaf and foil size is great because let's say you have like a little detail on something, you wanna add a little gold to it or a little silver. Um, you just paint the leaf and foil size wherever you want that glitz and glam to come up. So that, it's really, really simple. You just paint it on. So once your, um, your piece is ready to go and it's nice and snappy and tacky, you're gonna take your foil and you're gonna put it matte side down. Everybody always wants to put the shiny side down, but that's not what you do. And even if you do, it's okay, because you can just fix it. So you're gonna put it down, you're gonna press it onto the surface. I would normally have a brush or something like that except I forgot, and then you literally peel it off. So now you can see there's some areas where it's a little bit heavier, a little bit lighter. You just kind of put your piece back on there and you peel it off and you keep going until you get the coverage that you want. Now, the great thing about this is you can leave it solid. You can make it a little bit see-through. It's really your preference. But say you want this little area to be filled in, you could just take a little bit more size go over this area, wait till that turns clear again, and then add your foil on top. So this is so fun. It's very fun to see this happening because it's like instant glitz, instant glamour. Who doesn't love that? Now, I said it's three steps, right? So we have one more step to go. We would want to go ahead and put on our top coat. So that size is not going to stop being tacky or sticky until you actually put something on top of it. So you want to go ahead and seal it with either Artisan Enhancements Clear Top Coat or Artisan Enhancements Clear Finish. Either one of these products works great for this. What's the difference? Clear Finish is going to give you a little bit of a shinier finish. Clear Top Coat is going to kind of dull down your foil just a little bit. Um, here's an example that we did. Um, this was, I, I'm sure you've seen these in the thrift stores and the antique stores. They're just little ceramic figurines. This one was painted all kinds of different colors, um, but we put a little gold foil on him and really dressed him up. So, um, and then we used the clear top coat, which you can see this is kind of a little bit duller than this kind of a finish. So that's the difference between the two. Here are some other boards that we did. Um, this again, I think this was done with the clear top coat. And this one over here, this one was done with the clear finish. So this gives a little bit of a shinier kind of a finish here. 
Um, you know, we did a little clay pot. I mean, the possibilities are absolutely endless what you can do with this product. And like I said, um, if I had a lot of time on camera here, I could really make this entire M completely solid gold. So where can you get these awesome products? Well, you can come and visit us either in Huntington or Massapequa and buy any of these fantastic products most any day of the week except Mondays in Massapequa. Every other day we're open. Um, or you can shop online in your pajamas, 2 a.m. Do you live in Missouri, Tennessee? You're not in New York to come and visit us? It's okay. Jump online, sweetpieces.com. All of these fabulous products are there. We can't wait to meet you. We'll see you soon.